Hi guys, Kaiwai here. Welcome to, uh, what is this? Oh no, I've forgotten everything. WPF Off Season 4, Week 4, if that's what it is. Ha, <laughs> got him, I didn't actually forget. I actually did. But, um, we're against Cynthia of the Germany Giraffe Rigs. This time, Cynthia didn't help me build my team. I'm actually kind of, I'm not sure why she wouldn't have helped me win. But her types are Flying Fighting. And she has a Mega Pidgeot, Thunderous Therian, Skarmory, Mean Chow, Haunch Crow, I believe every form of Oracorio is available to her, Gliscor, Hip on Top, Zatu, Masquerine, and Normal Gyarados. Uh, still kind of an interesting team. Weak a lot to Rock, Electric, and Ice. So I've just kind of brought that. If you see, I've got like Thunderbolt, Duralodon. I don't think it's going to put in nearly as much work as it did before. Uh, hmm. Do I have Defensive Gudra? I don't have Defensive Gudra. I feel like you need to be defensive. Uh, I, I specifically remember today I wanted to make a defensive against who... Um, I think Physical Bulk is kind of what I want to invest in right now. So I'm, I'm going to do that. There we go. A uh, slight change in the last second there. But yeah, I assume that many things, including Gliscor and Thundee, are coming. Because I have a little Draco Zolt, who's running Hustle Stone Edge, which is a 64% accurate move, which is the best thing ever. However, I'm running the Super Heat of Gravity, which is gra gravitatious. <laughs> I, I don't know, I don't have any earthquakes or anything to hit everything here with. But the thing is, is that if I use Gravity and then go in on Draco Zolt, none of my attacks can miss. And that includes Stone Edge. So if you go into Thundee T, you know, not, not a super huge fan of that. Do I have my Calculator of Pain up? Do I? I need to check. I'm also waiting for the, the thing where I go into a match. So, no, I don't actually have my correct custom sets in here. Good thing I noticed that beforehand. Ba -da 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 -da. Import and export. Go back to the list. Oh, go back to this. There we go. Like I said, I don't think September is going to put in nearly as much work as they have at this point, but it, it's still, you know, it's, it's a thing. I actually haven't calc this against Gly score really. Gly score. let's say you are Swords Dance. How much does uh, Stone Edge do? Stone Edge only does 37%. Are you, like, what is with you? Why does Average do so much more? I need to. I need to stop being dumb. I, I guess I'll shift this to this so we can see if I ever get anyone who ever likes me. Uh, I don't know how to do basic math. Wait, that's not math. I always forget that ground resists rock because I don't. This just doesn't make any sense to me. That's just weird. I don't know. Being neutral to rock makes Stone Edge kind of bad. Do you not get anything else? So, like, Outrage. I mean, I have Facade here. Do you get anything that's ice or water? I doubt it, because I would have probably clicked it. Oh, you get Rain Dance. That's great. Yeah, I can't really do much against a Gliscor, which is not great. <laughs> I can click Outrage, and it hurts. It clicks Earthquake, and I die. So, I mean, I don't think it has fairies. Yeah, there's no fairies I have to worry about. I don't think any Oracorio can be fairy. There's electric flying, firefighting, ghost flying, and... What's the last one? Is the last one fairy, or is it... It's pink. Oricorio. Or Oricorio. Don't ask me why I'm trying to figure out what Oracorio is. Psychic flying. Okay. It's not fair. I didn't think there was any fairies that I had to worry about. The Poe style. There's there's a Bale. Yeah, I think she you can use any thing fun. But they're all weak to electric except for Pom Pom, which is still weak to ice and rock. They're all weak to rock, I think. With Bale style being very weak to life. Also, I didn't... I, I, Shiny Oracorio is actually really nice. 
and then it didn't get put in Sword and Shield, and Dancer is kind of interesting. I know, I feel like they could have, does you think Orokorio is going to come into the, the island? That'd be cool. DLC put Orokorio in. Am I, am I going to get battled anytime soon? I'm, I'm waiting. We're chugging. I, d I guess I'm just going to chill here a bit longer. I didn't think she'd take this long. Oh god, what am I doing? Uh, I, d I don't think there's a whole lot that I've prepped for in terms of Mean Shao and Hitmontop. I do have, obviously, Latios with Psychic, and I have uh, Mega Altaria with Return, just pixelated. And so th those are good responses. More so the Psychic. If Hitmontop comes, I don't think Hitmontop comes. I mean, it's possible. I think it's very plausible just because of the fact that Ice types... It's expected for me to bring a lot of ice types, I feel, because of the whole entire flying being weak to ice, but I'm just bringing dragons with ice coverage. It just makes sense to me. I don't know. Also, I feel like taking Blizzard over Ice Beam might be the play, just because I have access to Blizzard, but it takes a whole, whole entire turn of setup. I don't know. It's extra damage at something... Not a bad idea. I thought about... So this is actually a very defensive set, so I can actually get up gravity. I thought about running a Soul Vest, and then I realized I actually have to not have a Soul Vest in order to run gravity, and that, that plan wasn't going to work. So here I am, going to be running gravity, into, so I can throw these birds onto the ground. I can't miss anything. Also, I think Skarmory provides a problem for... No, it doesn't provide a problem for Ghost Rider. What the fuck am I saying? It probably just dies, right? Physically defensive... It gets obliterated by Bolt Beat. Get that shit out of here. Oh, yeah, and uh, Scarf with 172 speed EVs at speeds Mega Pidgeot, which is the fastest thing on her team. So the only way that it will be outsped is if something here has a Scarf, which is likely, or uh, if they have a boost in speed by any degree. Although the slower ones with speed boost might not. Like, uh, I don't know. Gyarados? How, how fast is Gyarados? Okay, Gyarados? Dragon Dance... Oh, absolutely. If you're at max speed plus one, yeah, you're you're out speed and everything. But you still die to a bolt beak regardless. Um, after a dragon dance, I don't take much from anything you have, and bolt beak just obliterates this mon. There's nothing that Gyarados like Gyarados doesn't want to be anywhere near Draco's ult. My goal is to keep it healthy enough though that we can keep putting it into gravity and just have zero issues. Cause hustle is scary. If I miss things. So that's, that's, that's always fun. It's cool. It's nice. Why I haven't I gotten an invite yet? Uh, I don't know. Uh, this is this is fun. I might end up cutting some of this out. Because this is taking a while. I'm just constantly looking back at this team. And it's giving me time to rethink things. Uh, the Raldon has Stealth Rock. But I don't, I don't really know how useful it is. Because I don't think I ever click it. The problem here is that, yeah, almost the entire team is weak to it in some way. But it's got, this team has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 defoggers and 1 rapid spinner. Meanwhile, it's got 1 spiker, 2 stealth rockers, and a sticky weber. Who, I actually do think I need to be a little wary of. So here, here's the match. Uh, that was the right team. Yep, alright. Let's go in. Let's hit it. Oh, I have no music on. Wonderful. So, did things I expected to come, come? Yeah, um, actually, super good news. There's no Gliscor. Came with the electric immunity, so both the fighting types, I kind of figured. Um, this whole team can get run down. Well, all the flying types can get run down by a... Can get Link? Yeah, I will. Uh, get run down by Draco's ult, just going in. So it's super helpful in this regard. Uh, got a battle ping, bro. Battle ping, there we go. I think I did that right. Let's see. Yes, there's a bot here. Cool. Ugh. So, Skarmory could lead with spikes. But both of the fighting types here 
I think, put in work against Duraludon. It's not even that defensive of a Duraludon set, so I can definitely see it being, seeing it being a thing. What's that word? Wording. Mean Shao. Why is Mean Fu coming up for Mean Shao? Uh, high jump kick will obliterate me while... Like, there's a, there's a good chance I, I die instantly. Paralyzing it, though, I think would be huge if I could get a pair off from Thunder Wave. Um, I'm on top. He gets close combat, yet again, looking at... Not in her favor to destroy. Why must you give me notifications? Ah, if you leave with Skarm, we have s some form of something, though. Skarmory... Yeah, I, I think we just kind of kill you with Thunderbolt. We don't kill with Thunderbolt. <sighs> Master Rain didn't come, which is great. Glyscor isn't here for Stealth Rocks, and Skarmory's are only Stealth Rock and Spiker, so I think... Okay. So here's the thing. Uh, if she risks the high jump kick and gets the full KO, then that's really bad, and we need to just figure it out, but I just kind of click, okay, you're Aura Sphere, so you're special, which is really interesting to me, because an Aura, an Aura Sphere, in order for Aura Sphere to kill, you need to probably be, like, not jolly, so that's not a great start, but that's fine, I think. Would be plus speed minus attack. I don't know where that is because this calculator really needs a thing that's not listing them in alphabetical order. So that's fun. It's best wife in mind. You used Aura Sphere. <laughs> and there we go. Timid. Uh, max special attack. Yeah. Okay. So you're very likely max special attack, max speed, no bulk. A fair judgment here, which does mean that let's see how Regice takes it. Or uh, fear it doesn't hate. I have Blizzard now too. I can check that, but like it doesn't change much of the context here. Or is gonna hurt a lot. Uh, Gudra doesn't care about this mod at all, quite frankly. Like, at all, at all. I kind of want to go in and just... At this point, I don't know what you do, but I... Get out to it anyways. Clicking Dragon Tail actually does the most damage here while getting it out of my face. So, yeah, knock off. Uh, so, you've left... Your speed has fallen. There goes my Assault Vest. Uh, goodbye. <laughs> Hi! You're a Skarmory who doesn't want to necessarily take a Thunderbolt. I'm just going to click do, 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 uh, Flying Electric. So you are weak to ice. I mean, I can just... I mean, you probably toxic me more than likely. Or click Roost or something. I don't... I just use, yeah, I don't know. So it having regenerator, does Dragon Tail regenerate it? Actually, <laughs> probably does. I didn't think about that fully. That's weird. Uh, is that how that move work? How that ability works? Because it didn't switch out. I force it out. I assume it still heals. Pokemon switches out of battle. It, Serbi, thank you, but like, Pia, uh, oh, bro, that is a freeze. Um, that that's lovely. I will take a freeze. Okay, I don't know if you stay in at this point. Ugh. Uh, 
I don't know if you stay at this point. How much do we think a Dragon Tail is? Like nothing. I don't think there's a reason not to. So Ice Beam did 22%, which that to me tells me this is a spadefive one. Probably plus spadef minus attack. It's possible. If that was a high roll, maybe. Ugh. I don't want to click flamethrower here and have it go into something really easy, but like, there we go. 39%. Um, it's not a reason to just click flamethrower again, I guess. It's unfortunate it thought out. We're gonna have to defog a little later, but. I just guess our one rocker is gone already. I was hoping for a crit. Ooh! That helps a lot. The, the hacks are kind of real right now. And Roost is unfortunately doing a lot more than I would like. I don't know what you have, but if you had any physical moves, you're not doing much. Of course, you're just going to heal more than I can get off of you. Which is fun. I can't freeze you at this point, so I'm just kind of... Going for a crit, I guess. Because you're just roosting over and over again. I don't know. Taking a while to pick. It. I don't know. I don't feel like I want to sit here and just spam flamethrower all day long. Especially because it's pretty much free entries for Gyarados. Uh, I don't know why I said it like that, by the way. I'm just Go to there we go. Think click buttons. There we go. I figured it out. <laughs> uh, Garados. Okay, you just heal up again. Thanks. So you do get out sped, but I don't die really immediately or anything. I just kind of click, keep clicking flame I don't really see a reason not to. Uh. I think wasting all of your roost PP will happen before I run out of flamethrower PP, so. And obviously I think she's going to full health, which is whatever. If I get a crit, it'll be longer. You don't have infinite sustain. Oh, spikes. That's fun. That's fine. I'll... Ooh. A crit there would have been really nice. I know this stall out stuff is going to be fun. I probably need to go into Altaria soon in order to actually defog that away. I figured it was coming soon. Ugh, the, the amount of roosts left is disgusting because we're not even halfway through all of them. And you're just, you're just here as utility. So, you know, Panzervogel. Also, we had number one waifu. Poke waifu number one. Because she's adamant about the fact that Gudra is not a good waifu, but whatever. Ugh. I don't do any more damage with either of these, and there's really no reason not to just spam this. And I think she doesn't want to send in Gyarados into a flamethrower, because the 10% burn would suck. I'm going to set up more spikes, I assume. Running low on roosts, so... I need whatever... Because the thing is, if you have no more steel type, I don't mind defogging. It's not a concern of mine. And you have, like, no roost left, and you're the only thing I have flamethrower for. So I don't mind going through my nine more flamethrowers. At this point, like, oh, the crit. Crit helped a lot. It didn't win me anything, unfortunately. So I can't do 57 in one go. I think it meant literally nothing. Actually, it might have been like less spikes that are here, but I'm going to go into my flying type that turns into a fairy type, so I don't really mind. This is your last ability to roost, so have fun doing that. And what, you set up spikes and then like whirlwind or something? I don't know. 
I don't think you're offensive in any way. Uh, spikes more. I might not kill you here. There we go, okay. I actually got the kill. The roll was a little... Uh, roll might have been in my favor, I don't know. I have three flamethrowers left, but you're not the one I needed flamethrower for. And also, I'm so hazard stacked right now, but I think... If Altaria dies, I need to just go into... Who I can. Ice Beam... Does not do much to Gyarados. The thing is, a Thunder T probably wants to stay alive in order to absorb whatever I have for Draco's ult. Mean Shao, I can only assume, is at full HP. Uh, it's not suppressed. Trace, which is out. Heal block. <sighs> yeah, I don't think using Dragon Tail makes it so it doesn't regen. It's pretty much at full health. It, it's 5v5, except one of my mons is weakened down, and I have a lot of hazards on my side I need to clear out here. I've, I've got a lot of power plays still left. I, the heat of gravity hasn't been revealed, and I think one of the bigger things stopping me is gone. Stone Edge is res unfortunately resisted by two of the mons here. But if I get a good opportunity to go in, I will. Like if I'm trying to think, because special special mean view doesn't touch reg ice right now, which is good. I mean, it's more of a defensive reg ice. So even if you click knockoff or whatnot, it doesn't mean that much. Probably take nothing to the knockoff, honestly. So it, it's a position I could be in. Unfortunately, September died without doing anything. Uh, so that's that's not good. That, that's a death that it, it didn't didn't want. And also Skarmory decided to just be annoying that whole time. Set all these hazards that I'm going to promptly get rid of as fast as possible, although I'm going to take a decent bit of damage from this, the rocks, but if I defog it away, I don't mind that much. Yeah, I'm just trying to think this through. Levitate makes it so I only take damage from the rocks as well. So, not a bad mod to run defog on either, but I, I didn't decide to run defog. Because, whatever. I needed the psychic stab more to more effectively handle the fighting types that are on the team. And I think the, the long decision time here is indicative of the fact that losing Skarmory is not optimal. It gets rid of uh, something. It gets rid of the ice. Uh, I should say it's from control. Alright, hi, Goku if I ogle. I... Okay, so we're gonna look at Pidgeot. I haven't done a whole lot of calcs revolving around this thing. die after a hurricane. I can click Ice Beam. Like, ow, but... Oh, don't, don't, don't hit myself in confusion. Okay, there we go. That was about to be real bad. I... I don't want to hit myself in confusion. Also, oh, this is a small chance I don't think Hurricane even kills me here. I think I need to just go down. Because I don't want... That's fun. I roost, you know. Thunderbolt's not doing any extra. Ugh. I need to freeze again, you know. This is gonna be fun. I, I need to check how much this is gonna do to me. So, rocks are on the field. Mega Altaria, it does 
is a lot. Do, do, do. Uh, do I have speed though? I don't. I don't want to take all this damage though. No, Latios doesn't mind actually. Alright, I think I need to go into Latios. I mean, it's Latios with three sets of spikes. Oh no, 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 I'm fine. I haven't lost that much health. Ice Beam. I'm Expert Belt, so... You can assume I'm going to Gyarados. I don't know if I outspeed. 256, I don't feel like I do. Actually... You're gone. That's good. I'm running out of. Unfortunately, your your electric answer is still here. And Gyarados is still here. I've been afraid to click my electric moves because of it. Ugh, because of the hazard stack, I'm not in a great situation. I wanted that thing out of my face though. this point forward. Nothing outspeeds Draco Zolt. But I want gravity so desperately, but Spikes is what, 25%? Like, I think going in takes Reg Ice down to 50% automatically. Which is not good at all. I have to go into Altaria soon. <laughs> If you're max speed jolly, you can outspeed me with Gyarados, and that's fun. I need to click Roost if I want to live anytime soon, though. And you know I have a response for Thunderous. The question is, do you think I have Thunderbolt? Because it's very likely... I have a response for every single one of these mons in terms of actual offensive damage, especially with an expert belt. I can probably Oko everything. Uh, you die to an ice beam. And I can only assume Queen like, Chow dies to a psychic. Yeah, even a salt vest with spadef investment, and we know for sure it's not that dies to psychic, and so hit on top obviously dies to. So everything, I I have the ability to Oko everything. Uh, should I be afraid of Minchow? Because you do outspeed me. However, you are some form of offensive that I don't like. Uh, special attack. With Aura Sphere. I mean, Aura Sphere, I don't, I'm not afraid of. Hi. Okay, so I figured you are coming out. Yeah, alright. And that's fine. Because you're going to switch out. <laughs> you either switch out, or you die. It's just, that's the rules. Those are the rules I'm giving you right now. Because I'm at 88%, I don't think you kill me. You can test it if you want. I'm fine with losing a whole mod if it means that Gyarados goes down. If I can't show off Gravity Stone Edge, because I win with this, that'll be interesting. Ugh. I think the biggest thing of being afraid of is that, like, this is gonna hurt. Whatever you do is gonna hurt. If you just keep switching around to for predicts or whatnot, you're just gonna take damage for no reason. So I think in general, I I'm not in a bad spot. I can win from here. Cause the, I don't think I die unless there's a crit. Which knock on wood, because there's been some odd hacks this game. 
Uh, I'd have to go into Altaria. I don't think Altaria takes it well. Can I make it a defensive set? I might. However, I can survive and defog, which is which is probably my best bet. Cause then I switch into Reg Ice if I die. Then I just gravity, I guess. Well, I can thunder gravity. Iron head, huh? All right, the para. That was something. So walk on Barry. You have nothing. You are no no more. At plus one. Not a good job, uh, domino. You are para. I think I would speed. You went for Iron Head, which is good to know that you have. Because that would obliterate Reg Ice. <laughs> 45% makes sense. I absolutely have speed. But does. I think Psychic even kills. So I'm just gonna go for Psychic because it's safe. Actually, Ice Beam kills, even. I don't know. Psychic like Sinkist. It's stab, it's whatever. Because if you pivot out in the Thunderous, it dies. It doesn't die. That it doesn't die from Psychic. But if you go into him on top or Bean Shao, they die. Um, thunderous for Volt Absorb doesn't appreciate that much. And Iron Head absolutely will uh, just blow back Altaria um, Omega. So, I mean, we do get Defog off first still. And then we can, like, clap with a return. But I, I don't think we die here. I, I, I genuinely think she just lets go down. The, obviously, the hacks has been pretty brutal. The, the freeze, the burn, the para. But I did get confused, although I never hit myself. I never got a good crit on the Skarmory thing. All things considered, I've had pretty good hacks, I'd say. Uh, I don't know. I want to defog and then clean with gravity. Because it, it feels like it's going to be so good. Because it just, it's, it's lovely. Yeah, there you go. Get out of here. Uh, don't say it that early. Because that is... I still have problems with the fact that I have a whole bunch of hazards on my side. And anything can really happen. Well, I guess you don't do anything, Eladios. Do not. Nothing now that can touch soul. I lost. Yo, you haven't even. You're not even ready for the gravity. I'm so sad that I'm not gonna be able to show off Stone Edge in gravity. The pure hacks. Uh, I still had wind cons. I still had wind cons. It's okay. I still have wind cons, obviously. Just pivot around with Mean Shao, because I used Dragon Tail on it for some reason. <laughs> but hey, I don't have to worry about using Thunderbolts, because there's no reason to. Hi, Mean Shao. Now, you probably blow me back. I can't imagine that I survived this. Respectfully. <laughs> um, so let's say you're you're timid, not serious. Stop. Like aura sphere. Knock off. Can actually kill here. I don't really see a reason in doing anything but just clicking, clicking psychic. 
because, like, I wasn't gonna heal off that, and you have to go into someone specifically. You, I don't know if you have Iron Headed on anything. Whatever you go into is gonna determine my next few moves here, because I think I have to go in and defog with Mega Altaria in order for something like Zolt to go in that hard. I don't think she would have won by just killing me instantly because I survive an Iron Head with Altaria. And. Actually, wait. No, this, the rocks would have hurt, but. Would that, would that matter? I'm Maxi. Mm, that's fair. Do you Oko Reg Ice, though? I'm curious about that. Gyarados. Add a. Plus two. Nothing on you. Plus two attack. Does Iron Head kill you? I have to assume it does. No, I actually survive. Um. That's what I don't really care at this point. I got the hacks. It's here we are. <laughs> the problem is the hazard stack. Like I said, I needed to get out Altaria faster because that would have put me in a really bad situation. But Are you seriously okay though? After three spikes, I think it wasn't. If it's not for Stealth Rock, yeah. If, it, if there's no hazards, I would have still had it. That's fine. <laughs> I don't I don't know what that what that's gonna mean here with this whatever. Uh after leftovers recovery and the stealth rocks and stuff. I don't know. That great if you, why did my icon change? I just realized my avatar is different. That's interesting. Does he actually have speed max speed and soul? At plus one speed? Probably. I can imagine you do. I think I calc that, yeah. It's because it's not the fastest mod in the world, but that's why we're not max speed. Whew. Honestly, had things gone a little differently, I don't think I would have been in that position in terms of, like, who the Skarmory staying in as long as it did, not getting crit, uh, Gudra living how it did, has had... Honestly, and Gudra died... Wait, wait, how did, how did it go again? I need to remember Gudra... There's a lot of fun through and roost. So Goku Vogel killed Gudra. And I was afraid of the Hurricanes KOing. I think to be in the best position possible, I should have just... So they finally made a decision into Thunderous T, in which case I don't think you do anything to Altaria. Mega Altaria. You HP flying me to death, and then I dragon on your dance. Well, I, I should probably click a roost. 
boost. But... So do that. You have to speed me. I click roost. Hi. Thunder wave. Oh, goody. Fun. I need to defog immediately. Pure thunder wave. Have fun. I don't know how much damage you're gonna do. I wasn't expecting a thunder wave, and I'm actually really hoping that I do get the defog off, because the thing is, I need to live. Please don't get parried. Okay. That's very good. Actually, your lowered evasion probably just lets me come in anyways. Uh, does it? Huh. Let me think about this. That's fine. How do I beat this right now? Because it has flash cannon. So you're running flash cannon. Oh, I kill you with ice beam, okay. I don't kill you, but like, or blizzard. Oh, actually blizzard probably does kill you. There's a good chance of it. I'm going to hope, so let's see, oh god, so it's 1 divided by 0 0.75, so that's just 1.33, so yeah, 0 0.7 times 1.33, this is a 93% accurate move. Or, I can click gravity and make it 100%. Wanna <sighs> go blizzard first and then gravity. I'm really hoping this works. Because Losing Altaria the way I did was bad, but it let these, the two mons that I needed to be my sweepers at the end here have so much more long longevity than they have had. Uh, fighting, I don't even know what item you are. Bolt switch, okay. That does suck, actually, a lot, and Blizzard don't miss. Okay, cool. That gives me some information here. Being hit on top. Um, oh, close combat doesn't kill, I don't think. The problem is that we're, we, we'll be scarfed at that point. Ah. Do I outspeed that was the question? I doubt it. I don't. And also not intimidate. Steadfast technician. You're a technician. In which case, some of these moves hurt a little bit more. I mean, you went to close combat, and then mock punch me. You taking 40% of Blizzard. Uh, it seems about right for what the set is. <sighs> I have to believe this is gonna work. not good. I, I think we can still get gravity off. Please don't die to close combat. It'll be really bad if you die to close combat right here. We need to get gravity off. Unfortunately, I cannot KO. Genuinely cannot KO. Yes! That's huge. And Blizzard's free. I'm only gonna have a few extra turns of gravity. 
I only get two. <sighs> All right. You die to an outrage. It's fairly guaranteed. Mock Punch comes out. I don't have a choice. Bolt Beak would be bad because then I literally can't win. Stone Edge, I can't break you. It really comes down to clicking Outrage and getting the three turns of Outrage. And gravity only lasts so long, so I only have guaranteed Outrages here temporarily. I really wish that I could switch out so I could change up my move to not be Outrage. I mean, Mean Shao using Knockoff could genuinely I mean, not knock off, like, you turn and fake out, wear me down enough. I, I don't know the exact. It, it's probably likely that I can't live here. Um, the fighting types remaining made it very hard to use Stone Edge. I couldn't click Bolt Beak as free as that was. Hi. I genuinely believe you died to Outrage. You didn't. Oh, God. That's good, though. Well, it was good. I still have to click Outrage. Uh, I think that's GG. Because uh, I... Like, I mean, it's obviously GG, but I, I don't think I win. I can choose any move I want, but I'm not Scarfed. I need to keep that in mind. I literally have no speed. Fake out and the high jump kick kills. I mean, fake out into literally anything kills. Um, I just, there's no reason not to click out reach here. Uh, that was dumb. Uh, I shouldn't have lost that. That was actually not something I should have lost. Uh, that was me making a bad play. I think the problem that caused it was the fact that I didn't get... That was filled with nothing but hacks. Uh, you lose rights to come play with him. Lose. There you go. <laughs> I, I think the problem is, is that... Wait. Win. Uh, just how I handled the, the hazards wasn't fast enough. It was not great by any means. It's, it's a very m minimal loss, I think. I don't think it's going to hurt that bad. <sighs> but it's really sucky that the way that went down is how it went down. Because <sighs> I'm just trying to think of what I did wrong with... The problem is I couldn't. Have, I didn't predict Flash Cannon. Because not knowing that Flash Cannon existed, I don't know. I think it's letting it Thunder Wave me, and then I needed to click Defog, and then Roost, and then I think it would have been a bit more enabled to do something in that situation. It it came down to the end just because of some hacks and stuff. I, I don't like how it went down. That's fine. Next week... I am against... Actually, I don't know who I'm against. I'm against... Oh, no, Stumbles. Who, <laughs> who is electric... Electric. So, just pure electric. That's fun. Um, that's that's going to be interesting. I don't know if we're actually going to do that. Well, I, I mean, a lot of our mods resist electric, so there's something. Yeah, uh, I'll see you later.